Welcome to Buhay. Oh, come on. May Ma asawa. No. <laughs> Episode 11 ni. Mag-asawa. Mag-asawa. Okay. Our guests are still here, Bianca and Busy Kev, because he has a workshop. It's gonna fall. You have to hold it. Yeah. Oh, see, it's hot. Come on, babe. Alright. Okay. So our topic today is care of this. What's our topic today? Things to discuss before you get married. Get married. Okay. Why did you decide? Why Why did this topic come around? Sa Sa mind mo. Kasi na naisip ko kanina umaga. Ano ba yung mga dapat na papag-usapan ng mga engaged na? Na, na, iya, na minsan hindi na papag-usapan pero kasi kailangan mo siyang harapin pagkasal na kasi so usually pag-usapan lang sinong ninong, sinong yeah. ninang garden wedding, uh, garden wedding, reception ilan yung guests, ilan yung guests ano yung food but there are more important things that you can talk about kasi the and, wedding is yeah. just one day and more important things na you assume padaho kayo pero baka apparently okay. hindi for example pala. Um, Where will you live? Yes. After you get married, kasama ba in-laws mo, parents mo? Are you uh, open to living yeah, with them or, or not? Or you should live alone or live uh, bukod na. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kasi diba, they say, mahirap to have two queens in the house. So it's always better if you step, if you can, diba? No. Tapos else? number two is, how about the finances? Who handles it? Who handles it and what is the setup? Is it joint? Magkasama ba yung pera niyo or like may kanya-kanya kayo or what? Joint is yeah. always better because you know, you're together already and you should talk about your expenses. Uh, kasi mahirap nung you assign who spends for what. Mahirap yun because yeah. it always leads to uh, conflict in the future. Kasi parang, oh, I spend more than you, ganyan, mm -hmm. or bakit, ganyan. So, it's always good to put your money together and then just have someone deal out the expenses. Yeah. But uh, you're you're always together in everything. Ano pa? Ano pa isa? How many number of kids? Yeah. You want you plan to have. But open. You should always be open to as many kids as God gives you, diba? Kasi baka mamaya ikaw pala gusto mo isa lang so yung spouse mo gusto like five. So, syempre laking difference. Huh? In before, ah, baka umiyak na naman si Jax. <laughs> five. Okay. <laughs> These are the questions you should really talk about before you even uh, decide to move forward and get married because people don't really talk about these things so it's always good pag iba kayong religion ano yung ayun yun lalo na yun yung um, in terms of faith yun so um, syempre I guess pag magkaiba ng religion obviously kailangan talaga mapag-usapan yun I hope napapag-usapan yun pero like even naman if you're the same um Kasi kami ni Javi, hindi naman kami different in that. Kasi nga, we met in community. We were both full-time workers. So, parang kami na, oh, we will continue to be active here. Oh, we go to church every Sunday, mga ganyan. Pero yung... Non-negotiable. Yeah, yeah, pero Mahirap yung... Mahirap yung ibang faith. I think that's really something that's going to be a big issue. So, I don't know. You should really talk about that. Uh, bring them to the Catholic faith. Uh, yeah. Explain why you are Catholic because diba, it, it's it's your faith so it's something that you have to be passionate and really convinced about so it's always good to be together that's right pag LDR dapat mahirap yun mahirap yung LDR um, you should, there should be a plan na you're, you end up together on a certain, certain day number hindi pwede open-ended yeah. lah LDR lang kayo ano pa rin po ay yung mga issues wala na ako maisip wala <laughs> Pero marami yan, mga especially money, in-laws, where to spend the vacation, di ba? Spend Christmas, New Year. Because, um, di ba, it's a joining yeah. of two families. So, you really have to talk about those things. Birthdays, uh, things like that. And sometimes, baka minsan di rin mapapag-usapan kasi hindi pa mangyayari. Pero yun nga, important pa rin, you communicate. Yeah. And if you're going to support your in-laws or your parents financially, Yun, isa pang sticky issue yun. I think it should be clear from the start. If you're gonna give money, how much, monthly bag, and that. So these things are things you as a couple should really sit down, seriously talk about, and agree on. Yes. Yeah. So that's a good topic. That's good. Congratulations. Thank Contribution. You. All right. So see you again. Not tomorrow because may mga sorti ako tomorrow in Laguna. If you're in Laguna, I hope to see you. Um, but we'll see you again next time. And buhay!
Bukal 166 and buhay may asawa. <laughs> okay, see you. Bye.